Greetings. This is General of the Armies, Vincent Diaz, Jr. This is a communique for Vladimir Putin. Attention to all world leaders. CC all stakeholders. BCC, all those I've proposed can join I in my perfect quarantine I've trained for and have expressed exactly how I can achieve, basically. I'm going to get into those terms. I have some terms of um, what is going on here. Yeah. About how to identify um, these sides again. With, you know, there's those of us, the innocent victims who um, have been locked out of quarantine, basically are given no quarantine options, not given any relief, any COVID relief. And then there are those who are um, not in this situation. I don't necessarily mean all of those not in this situation we are. But this is basically my case. The way I'm against the whole species. As I'm just coping with it not making it. The way I'm just so upset. I'm going to express it with me and the whole species. As it usually winds up this way on the ledger. So this is the term I had to lecture everybody within shouting distance after shouting started here last night, but not directly here. It is, what do you think you're worth? Because of the understanding we need to have about what worth means. As I can't even define you as being capable of knowing what the word worth means. By the way... What I'm worth is expressed here. I want to check against what you're worth. And you can't even define the word worth as the way I monitor it. Because you are worth you're, you are worse than worthless. You are worse than worthless. Because I am worth the most in the most ways. With the only way the society can express worth, that is, worthless, at least somewhat, it's the way it tortures. Although it is to no ends, the way it is at least total loss by it. With my inherent value, as the only value they express in this terms, being the most worth torture their system taking the most torture they prove is always worth it but my terms on their term on their terms not them actually defining the word worth the way I just defined it and their behavior meaning they don't know it and can't and won't is they are lost they are lost. Maybe even total loss. Right now, I'm having, I'm having the loss of communication rights. They are the loss of inalienable rights. They are the loss of rights. They are the loss of justice. They are the loss of arts. They are the loss of security. They are the loss of peace. They are the loss of righteousness. They are the loss of validity. They are the loss of survivability. They are the loss of community. They are the loss of society. They are the loss of anything social. To be claimed in the situation of this maximum decay of their entropy as their place in these systems. This way, there is no way left here to be claimed a social way. Because the loss they cause all here. So now I will prove my worth. And the way I'm going to negate and rebuild their loss of, to, of the decay of a near maximum entropy. The way their worth is this loss that is the torture. So they can have I being their most worthwhile way to take my peace. They are the loss of peace. To take the loss, cause the loss of health. So they take our health to cause the loss of our not being in pain. So they are the 
loss of that with their system based on the rewards that are their wages of the joy they take in being this suffering that is these losses like causing us pain they enjoy that causes our loss of joy and health and peace I want to flee if you can bring this new world order I can go to my proper place be it with a flock or alone with the animals that show the support so we have some sort of society and community that in human terms normal humans not those who are like animals out here in this different class don't even consider people I have trained and won at Fort Jackson I want Fort Jackson it's mine I've been there top rank I've won there killed everybody there to hold that place regularly been in command that condition there before I've had to support those needing those conditions because they would not follow code when we all needed them killed according to code I've had the support having them all killed so I held my command while holding the code to hold the code alone the way we killed them all it's the code it's upheld there this is one of these true proofs that this new world order to control at least by confrontation this emissary of God we have to kick out of our emissary system there regularly have can't work and be true to these people who basically know nothing until it slaps them in the face they cannot deny it here's the money here's my worth I want to fix up the system they have such a problem with about these monsters who won't allow automation so they can try to middle take to be the intervention to have human failure as a sure thing of them being there being total failures at everything this way these systems intervening to make sure it's there but it's perfectly not there till they break it down have an intervention point in the way, the way it won't fully fail till they are there to cause it by alienating natural rights driving us away because it's safer than trying to continue down the path of the maximum failure not the total failure they always push it through so I want to start at this issue I'm having with Walmart and Amazon this is almost built right I'm going to discuss how quickly this could get done if I was able ever if I was, if I could ever be able to give orders have them follow without having to hit this situation of what it always took we could only achieve at Fort Jackson and I could only basically achieve our missions instead of build and rebuild not just destroy to an acceptable state confirm continue on so it's a total the way the code does that for us we are this good at the Amazon locker there needs to be a rolling code lock system the rolling code lock system takes a code you set yourself with a system by having a receipt as if you had a trash a cash transaction with Amazon online and it only needed to be as simple as a cash transaction receipt of currency tendered product purchased these codes get what you need standard non-identifiable information goes on a receipt goes something like a locker number which is the first set where we can keep things right and identify problems locker number is an encoding system that goes into the lock locker number is supposed to be a two character number the, the code for the locker is supposed to be a four character number it's supposed to be a, an encoding 
the locker number, it goes into the lock when you get there to roll it the first time, no matter what. And the way it sequences to a pin code you set yourself. I haven't set a system for a reset besides a total failure retry to go well enough if only we cannot have to go too far through the system to get back to these physical points with an induction of physical travel. Upon first roll, there is an encoding to take place. To always be unique, the way the roll is unique, for a second encoding. By a second roll, for the confirmation that is compromised in the system. Not your PIN code that if entered in a way no one knows it except you, it's not yet divulged. This time it's not your locker number. It could simply be something that something based on that which you started with that is then encoded for this stage as your unique identification to access your locker. Sale item with a unique identifier in it is supposed to roll the code again on the lock so it hits your pin code we wish could be only in your mind at this point. If it should be that your item is not there yet, when you get there with a date, it should only be missed by early and not trigger a sequence of the time countdown starting as that should be set on the regular date. These things are put on an agenda, don't get to change. You should basically have currency there. Like you put currency in the exact same amount, at least, of the final, for the receipt. So I'm total. No tip transaction. If cash can't be there, we need an ATM next to it with this same sequence of events. Such that, at this point, Although I haven't figured it fully, your original transaction, well, your original transaction has a, yet again, another unique number. It's supposed to be the one so you can get to the ATM, put in maybe two characters, start the sequence like you've gotten to the lock again. Although, uh, at this point, you need to have two pin numbers memorized to do this best. You want them only in your mind. When you work through that system, get your cash back. While there should also be an option to try again immediately and at any point leaving this failed experiment of a failure of a transaction can't even count as one at this point. To just try again. Maybe in a different location, a different locker. The exact same thing proved to get here on time. This one failed. Get that one here now. With this system running appropriately, you can use this locker system of delivering our food of humanitarian aid that controlled so I can control my talk about the most inbred, monstrous inbreeds being those handing out our humanitarian aid in the most wasteful, monstrous, torturous way of maximum loss, having six people to the job of no one. And the way it costs us even six times the food of one person doing it. Like they get to have some of that food. They shouldn't just drop it and leave, which could be automated. They hand it out in packs of six sometimes. A person can't even get a meal that won't murder them in the conditions. Too much food to too little drink. Can't get more time. There are no excuses. You can show up the operations. I want this right at these sites and all over. So now I want to take our newspaper vending machines. I'm also talking about other vending machines. And have our food ready there. Well, I'm trying to make this point. Having any human anyway involved. It's a total loss failure unit. For sure! 
Will they always behave? Prove they will. They can. With that meaning, with them in the system, they can be well. I like it to be the locker system. Let's go to the locker system. You know, you know it doesn't have to be labeled. KFC, McDonald's. It's food, ready to eat, waiting. The standard units of the menu. Reasonable. You just take it and leave. If there's a failure on the locker open, try another. With it set up around the security of our ATM automation uh, foyer areas. Around our banks, this is being the standard one in, one out protocol. Security met, required to not just call down to the criminals. There's too much crime we don't get to. We'll call you the crime. We're victimizing, right? making you our victims. Crime winning. You don't get to where the crime says so. We also need free vending machines. So simple. The way these things are going so wrong. It's so stupid. It's so sad. It's almost funny. And now here's my explanation how quarantine can work according to the conditions. They went just almost funnily, idiotically, so sadly stupid. It's like they were just dead with their last brain cells firing off. This is all they were anyway. Many brain cell fires, as it has been. Anyhow, I have this intervention unit. This, 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 I, have, I, have a, I have an integration unit. I want to start this. Like, uh, if I can control my perimeter, I hold Fort Jackson alone. I can be a civilian entrance or an entrance, starting with standard security protocols, moving towards possible uh, an integration check, not a disease passing disease test. It is our system of this nuclear barrier glass with the rubber glove arms in it. But I start out. Uh, co re recoiled so that you can put your hands in and put them into the gloves or if allowed choose to open the gloves let's move towards human contact with the same thing on the other side one side within one side outside starting with I being the only one allowed to not use the gloves and then the other side being able to interact although they can choose I in gloves I, get, I not in gloves Shake a hand. Have human contact. This is it. With this quarantine, lockdown, logic is, as I demand anything that has escaped quarantine, even in the loosest conditions, they had quarantine. It was truly quarantine. They left it without all clear. Be destroyed. Have the mercy. I'm trying to build in the system. I can't feel it. The conditions. Never having the quarantine. Having these monsters. Have the quarantine. It's the best life they can ever have. To have a new life. An economy of reward wages. Torturing us. Including taking all indoors. All quarantine. All housing. If you have no survival conditions. Well they have those completely isolated. It's not enough. They flood and spill. To our zone, make it worse. Eyes that allowing us in the zone. They make it. As for being locked down in a single proper quarantine unit, all things have to do is maintain quarantine logic, segregated isolation, with the ability for regular contact, as I've just discussed. It's just one out till back in at a time with I being the only one allowed out at large having been completely denied any chance to be in before and then as the resulting pandemic quarantine lockdown with of course the grace of those who have never had proper quarantine also like I but not as severely these monsters are so lost thinking they own all like they're God with one out, they don't have to return the same place they left for it to be the one in, so no one's out, so the next one can get out. Although we don't want this failure, them to be going to the next unit as needed. In theory, never negated. 
with them having to arrive there with it locked and then open upon arrival. You can't always get right, which has always been a condition for them needing to be able to turn whence they came. Securely, return to a condition, zero out for another one out.